Hello. So, um, what was I talking about? Oh, yeah, prog. <laughs> I mean, I, I actually thought prog was dead at the end of the 70s. And uh, I, I didn't pick up on that whole neo-prog thing. Uh, and uh, I thought it was just, you know, it was killed by punk, all that sort of stuff. And, and, and about 15 years ago, I was um, looking pre-mobile phones, well, pre-smartphones, I was looking for something to read on a train. And I saw on the station magazine wreck a copy of a magazine called Prog. <laughs> and it had, um, I don't know, Gentle Giant or some band on the cover that really drew me in. And I bought this to read on the train. And not only had it a really interesting article about this stuff from 30 or 40 years ago, but all sorts of articles about new bands I'd never heard of. I did not know there was a Prog scene. And yet, there really was. And, you know, there, there really is now. And I got to know the editor of the magazine called Jerry Ewing, who is here today. And without Jerry Ewing, you know, the prog scene would not be, be what it is today. One of the things Jerry said to me a few years ago was that he was the, one of the guys who, who introduced post-rock as being a prog genre. And I thought, post-rock? Uh, and I see one or two people going, post-rock? What's that? Well, uh, you know, post-rock is possibly as difficult to define as prog, other than you can tell it when you hear it. <laughs> so we've got uh, four guys down from Halifax today, all the way down from Halifax to play for us. This is post-rock with a kick, with a twist. Please welcome LOE, Last of Eden.
afternoon, London. And the Bedford. I'm out of breath already. I think I say that at every gig. I've been running recently as well, and I'm still out of breath. It's supposed to be good for you. Uh, we're last of Eden, and as uh, Chris very rightly pointed out, we are from Halifax, West Yorkshire. So we've got a few songs for you tonight. We're going to be playing some uh, some as yet unplayed material that's going to be off album two, hopefully out in 2025. So uh, thank you for joining us.
or even possible extinction. 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 Thank you guys so much. So uh, this is our first day on uh, an autumn run of shows that we're doing. Um, so we're up in Liverpool next. But um, this is our first day, so it's a pleasure to be down in London. Um, and thank you guys for, uh, for coming out and sticking around.
it's uh, it's worth noting at this point as well a huge thank you to uh, to um, I am the Ravens and uh, to Reckless Eric who were absolutely fantastic um, and to the rest of the bands that are playing uh, this afternoon or this evening. So yeah, thank you guys so much. We're last of Eden. <laughs> Message from the Ravens. There's a big poster behind me. They got our name wrong as well, to be fair.
Thank you. So uh, I mentioned at the start that we were playing some brand new material that was going to be off album two. So this next one has never been played live before. So uh, it's the first time. So uh, thank you again for joining us with it. It's, uh, it's called Need Your Help With This. That's prog.
Thank you very much. I think uh, so far we've been the noisy band of the day, haven't we? Um, just, just a little bit. This next one's going to be uh, going to be our last one. Um, but thank you guys so much for uh, for sticking around and uh, for such a warm welcome. It's been a wonderful way to kind of kick off uh, this this autumn run of shows. We've got some uh, some vinyl copies of the album on sale at the back at the merch table. Um, I've got to do the obligatory plug. We'll be sticking around, so uh, we'll come say hello to people. But yeah, thank you guys so much. We've been last of Eden. We'll see you all again soon. Thank you. Before I forget, a big thank you to uh, to Chris and to London Prog Gigs as well. I'm not sure where he is in the room. There's the man. Um, for putting on such a wonderful show. So thank you very much, and thank you for having us on. Last of us, we will see.
your life. Don't let it be clubbed into dank submission. Be on the watch. There are ways out. There is light somewhere. It may not be much light, but it's the darkness. Be on the watch. The gods will offer you chances. Know them. Take them. You can't beat death, but you can beat death and life. Thank you guys so much. Thank you.